So they're giving away free tampons at the Columbus, Ohio uh, airport. Oh, but that's not the big news of the day. No, the big news is that the... Wow, that guy came out of me. The St. Louis Rams of the NFL are uh, moving to Los Angeles. So I don't know whether they congratulate Los Angeles or St. Louis based on that information. <laughs> um, I don't know anything about either of those, so... Neither do I. Now, those of you in the comments, discuss. Yeah. <laughs> Our job is done. I am now going to open a beer. Ow. That is not a beer. It's a root beer. Don't be 12. You're going to get tired of me saying that any time soon. Nope. Already happened. <laughs> so, I was thinking... Ow, fuck, fuck, fuck. Took fuck. a took a smoke break a little while ago. And I was thinking... um. People watch other shows, like gaming commentary shows on the internet, and uh, as far as I can tell, pretty much all those people are uh, are pretty positive. You know, they're always talking about, you know, happy things and how things, you know, look up and, and and you know, they'll, talk, they'll touch on some bad subjects, but they always end it on a happy note. And then I'm always concerned, like, then people come watch our show and it's like, oh god, I'm so alone. <laughs> Yeah, I gotta get some. That's sometimes. Just sometimes it just feels like I don't want to be. <laughs> I mean, I know we don't ever actually get like super dark, but sometimes I'm concerned about it because it's like I don't want people to watch a show and get bummed out, you know? Yeah. I don't want to bum people out, just in general. Well. Wow! Look like you were hanging onto the edge there for a second. Whatever, I'm glad that's over. Okay. Like, for example, I'll talk about, like, my shitty childhood home and <laughs> shit like that. Alright, so that's what you have to talk about these things. But, you know, I mean, all things considered, I have it pretty nice right now, so it's not like my life is actually hell. <laughs> oh, I have a pretty sweet, pretty sweet deal going on. Come on, you asshole. And, uh... Give me that baby face. I want you guys to know it's not all, uh, it's not all, uh, turtles down, you know? I don't think you know how to use that phrase. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> it's not turtles all the way down. Is that how you do it? Yeah, I guess. I don't know, isn't it like a Terry Pratchett thing or something? I don't know. It's turtles all the way down. Yeah, isn't I, that from, like, I think it's from Discworld that, or... Something? or Discworld or like Hitchhiker's Guide or something. I don't fucking know. Yeah. One of those British -y things. Is Terry Pratchett British or he's American, isn't he? I don't fucking know. My favorite uh, thing about Terry Pratchett, God rest his soul. Um, is he what? Yes, he is dead. Okay. I think. <laughs> correct me if I'm wrong. I'm pretty sure he's dead. Well, I'm not going to correct you if you're wrong because I don't know if you're wrong. I mean, somebody in the, in the comments, correct me if I'm wrong. I know nobody, nobody's going to comment. It's just a disclaimer. Like... <laughs> If it pisses you off, I'm open to being told that I'm wrong. That's all I'm saying. Yeah, I'm, I'm willing to admit that I'm opinion. wrong. I admitted I was wrong about Tails being yellow earlier. He's usually orange, apparently. I didn't know that. I learned something today. <laughs> well, fuck, damn it. But I would also like to state, for the record, and this isn't me being salty. This is just me on a conceptual level. The reason why I always thought Tails was yellow was because Sonic is blue and Knuckles is red and... Therefore, tails should be yellow because it's primary colors, and they do that. That's like a whole theme in the Sonic thing, is all this like primary color bullshit. That's why I always thought he was yellow. So I know now that he's mostly orange, but like that's dumb, and he should be yellow because that's like the theme that they're, that's the theming that they're doing, you know. So for him to be orange when they already have a red guy. That's gonna bother me yeah, now. Yeah, he was <laughs> like orange it, before there was a red guy. And this did, was it, and blue were like didn't Knuckles colors. also debut in Sonic 2? No. He didn't? No. He debuted in I thought he was like a Sonic bad guy 3. in Sonic 2. In Sonic 3, he was a bad guy. And I Sonic thought... And Knuckles, they knocked some bro into him, oh, and then he okay. stopped doing that. I thought it was... I thought it was in Sonic 2, he was like a bad guy, and then in Sonic 3, he was like a bro, and then in Sonic... And Knuckles, you get to play as him. I thought that's how it went. No. Ow. 
How do you how do you know so much about Sonic, man? I know plenty about the first three, and Sonic and Knuckles. Did you have those games? Yeah. Do you have them now? Uh, I have Sonic and Knuckles and Sonic Two, but I don't have the rest of them. Hmm. We should play those someday. On the show. Okay. I was talking about wanting to play games, Sonic games that people actually like. I'd like to maybe partake in some of that. Well, I'm not very good at it. Oh, I'll play it. Because I, I want to play it for my own, like, knowledge. Because I've been talking a lot of mad smack on Sonic for the last, like, five years, and I kind of need to, like, re-up my understanding of them. Because <laughs> up until today, I didn't realize Tails was orange. <laughs> it yeah. sort of opened my eyes to some things. Maybe, maybe you don't know as much as you think maybe you Maybe I don't know shit. But you know, man, that's that's the beauty Fuck of it. You, you gotta fucking piece of shit. <laughs> sometimes, sometimes you hate something, and then you have to revisit it to make sure you still hate it. That's oh, yeah. the beauty of life. I'm like that with Burger King. <laughs> <laughs> Is Burger King the one company that if they want to sponsor us, we're gonna say no? No. We're still gonna say yes. Yeah, we'd still say yes. <laughs> I'd absolutely say yes. I'll I, sell out. I'd be the burger. Yeah, dude. See, that's the thing. If we say from the very beginning that we want to be sellouts, then it's not going to surprise anybody when we sell out. <laughs> that's like this weird thing on the internet Fuck where, like, this fucking game. They hate like there's like a sellout hate. Like, if you ask or if you express any interest in earning money in doing anything ever, you're a sellout. Uh huh. Which is dumb. Like, there are people out there who are like, Hey, I'm a, I'm an artist. I've been doing this art, like, for free on the internet for, like, 20 years, and I'd really like to earn money and be supported. And then people are like, so out! Yep. So out! It's fucking weird to me. I'm gonna take it nice and slow. I got another round after this. If I don't win this one, I'm, I'll, I'll fucking skip this room, man. Man, you gonna leave it unfinished for all the people? I don't want to spend like 12 episodes. Do a super on mode. It. Yeah, go fuck them up. It's not gonna do me any good. They don't drop health in this mode. It's so. okay. Just go finish them. Finish them now. It won't matter. Woo. No, there's another round after this. I'm what? Fucked. Seriously? Yeah. Oh. The second round's the one I keep dying on. Oh. Except this time. Now I'm gonna do it on the first one. Just we change things up. Round. Wow. This is, uh, this is pretty tough. This is being a bit of a bitch. I, um... Okay, got the big guy. Okay. I did not realize this was being so, uh, difficult. Whoa! Nice. Damn uh, it! I hit the wrong button. Dick's on a dick! Alright, I'll try one more. Yeah, give it one more spin. I want to see you succeed in life and in this bonus stage. Me too. Mostly in this bonus stage. So I was really like, you know how there's like all those like Telltale games and they're usually pretty good, apparently? Uh huh. I was really looking forward to playing the, um, the Game of Thrones one that they came out with. Okay. Um, which I don't remember what it's called, but you guys know the one, the Game of Thrones Telltale game. Um, I believe that is its official title. I thought it had like some other shit. Whatever. I don't know. Apparently it's not good. Apparently it's like the one Telltale game that's like not good. And really? Yeah, apparently like, you know, they sell it as being like, oh, your choices have an impact on like how the story unfolds and, and all that shit. But it, that's not at all true. And it does that kind of Game of Thrones thing where no matter what, all the time the the bad guys win. All the bad guys have plot armor. Also, you're pitted up against like bad guys who are in the show, so you can't win. Uh, because they're in the show, and if you kill them there, then the show doesn't make sense. Yeah, which is dumb, like, because it's extra dumb, because they could pit you up against minor characters in the show who disappeared in the show. That would be a really good way for them to tie up a bunch of, like, loose ends and shit they're not gonna be able to tie up on the show. Yeah. But they didn't, they put you up against, like, Ramsey Bolton. And uh, nobody fucks with Ramsey. There's no way you're gonna be able to deal with Ramsey because he has the ultimate plot armor. <laughs> So, yeah, I don't know. I'm disappointed about that because it was the first Telltale game I was really looking forward to playing. And uh, apparently it's not that good. 
Most unfortunate. So I think instead what I'm going to do is uh, play some of the other ones. Like uh, Wolf Among Us. Wolf Among Us is solid. I never finished it, but... What's another Telltale game? They got that Borderlands one. Oh, yeah, I see. I don't know about that. I don't know if I'm willing to... Ow, what the fuck? Yeah, that's weird. Why did you get hit with it? It's... Interesting. Um, I'm not that interested in the Borderlands world, to be honest with you. I have, a, I have to like block out a lot of how that world works when I'm playing those games because it just doesn't make any fucking sense. So I don't really want to play a game that is like really story heavily based in that game world. Okay. You know what I'm saying? That world makes sense. I it kind of does, but like the just the sheer insanity of it is is a bit much for me to handle. Like, all the heroes in that game are fucking crazy. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> They're, like, un unmitigatedly insane. That's what makes them fun. Oh, uh, yeah, no, it's fun. It's, it's oh, what makes them shit. fun in the first-person shooter context, but uh, I wouldn't want to play a game that is, like, just a straight-up point-click adventure type thing. Because that would be, I don't know. Taking it a step too far. Um, I probably should have upgraded my weapon before I came back in here an additional time. Is there another one of those fucking wow, goddamn dude. pieces of shit? Can you not upgrade it while you're in here? Yes. Huh. Well. All right. What do we need? I need you yeah, better. Yeah, you need that pepper grinder big time, dude. Sure, I'm using the crap out of oh, that. Oh yeah, look at that. What else? I got nine hundo left. You're using that hobby horse a lot, dude. I am. Okay. Toss another hobby horse yeah, in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. The spiked Sweet. hobby horse. All right. Got a nice, uh, nice uh, razor blade on that piece now. See how that goes. Hope it does lots more. Ooh, shooting more. Seems to be shooting faster. Oh, fuck. fuck me. Fuck me. <laughs> Take the heat, rabbit. I'm bailing. You know, I will say, uh, lately, I, I used to play a lot of Call of Duty. Uh, I mean, not a lot, a lot, but I used to play a decent amount of Call of Duty, like, World at War and shit. Um, and then I quit playing ever since it got, like, you know, way out of hand. And repetitive. Okay. But, um, lately I've been thinking about picking up some Call of Duty again. Really? Yeah, I mean, I still don't like the whole Call of Duty kind of, uh... I don't know. What's the word one for? Uh, community type thing? Where the fuck wow. did he come from? I don't know, I guess he just... Blasted ass across the place. He was way the fuck out of the way a minute ago. Well, time to fuck him the fuck up now. God damn that pushback though. There you go. You yeah, got him. Nice. I did. Now you just gotta procedurally take these guys down. Okay, that shouldn't be too bad. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Don't get cannon. But I do kind of miss playing like the Call of Duty game. I was I was thinking about thinking back to all the like maps that I really liked and like Call of Duty 2 and shit. But I know it's not like that anymore, you know? It's not all World War 2 anymore. I don't get to play with like my Tommy gun and shit. Right. It's different now. They're all like they're all like modern shit. Or like future shit. Why aren't you shooting at the rabbit, you piece of shit? Don't break the game rules. Oh man, not every teapot has like rabbits. Oh god! Oh no! Oh, that was like the oh. last one! <laughs> uh. Maybe you'll be able to do it better with your uh, your new weapons. Maybe if I have them running the whole time. Fuck! 